All right, let's just take a quick look at this and uh, right side. I think we're good. Uh, let's go to our uh, front view. I think we're good here. I think this probably should go out a little bit. Let's bring this out. Yes, and then this guy, this guy can go in. Probably this guy here. If I go to uh, move that in. Yes. And I'll probably move this guy in a little bit too. I'll just use the element move tool. Bring that in. Bring that in a little bit. All right, we can bring this out. I'm trying to have as little as geometry as I can in this. And at this stage, it's just a matter of going in and selecting vertices and edges and just nudging them here and there just a little bit to match up to your background a little bit better. All right. Probably need to pull this guy out a little bit too. And even though we're looking at our object and it's very, very faceted right now, we're, the goal here is to try to get a, uh, an edge flow that is as graceful and smooth as possible. And I think, yeah, this might have to go up a little bit. Might have to slide this guy up. A little bit of sliding on him. Yes, I think we're getting there. And notice how I'm always rotating around the model, looking at it from every possible angle as I'm working on it. Yeah, much better. Much better. I might want to bring this in a little bit in. So I have a straighter line there right in here. I think we could go ahead and do a subdivision on this. I'm going to do a quick save. And let's go to subdivide this guy right here. Shift D. And this time it's going to be Campbell Clark. And we're going to go right there. All right. And I think there we have our shoe last. And just remember to save your work.